Hello everyone and welcome back to Metal Gear Rising Revengeance. In the last episode, we attempted stealth, something that Raiden probably hasn't been familiar with since the Big Shell incident, and apparently I'm not familiar with that either because I failed miserably. And in this episode, we're going to go at the party left. Woo! Party! Oop. Oh. Raiden, shall I activate your pain inhibitors now? No, keep them off. I need it this way. Ah, uh, well, as you wish. I must say, I have turned more than a few men into cyborgs. But you, well, your past is most, uh... What you getting at, Doc? Most of the time, you're working with first world ex-military. Grown men. Compared to the average third world child soldier, I can't really complain. Most of them, they're the sort of gorillas your typical patient gets paid to slaughter. Uh, perhaps, but, uh... This shouldn't be news to you, Doc. Uh, yes, yes, but, uh... Look, just help me take care of those brains after I bring them back. I do my business, you do yours. Uh, yes. Alright, and that wasn't the party elevator. This is the party elevator. This isn't the party elevator, but this is the party room. No collectibles, just run. Christ. Run away for the sliders that we could quite clearly. Oh, not clearly, because they're out the window. What am I talking about? I was going to say we could quite clearly, clearly wreck them. We really can't. Jeez, I'm getting old. Clear the area and using ninja run. See you later. <laughs> nope, wrong way. Uh, it, would help, it would help if I was looking at that. Hold this box. Mine. Jump it, jump it, jump it, jump it. Oh my god. This level gets really, 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 really crazy and I love it. This is like... This is a level I end up replaying the most after... Um, Monsoon's level because... Usually, after I get back for this game, I'm like, oh, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to play Monsoon's boss. And then I do that, and I'm like, right, I'm done for the day, and then I come back, and I'm on this level, and this is... Generally, I'm like, oh, let's just do this level, why not? And I'll, and I'll do it, and then I'll just not play for a while. Which, yeah, you know. Ooh, Gecko! I didn't know, <laughs> didn't remember that was there. Um, Up here, up here. Wait for that Gecko. I don't care about you. Keep going this way, follow the dots, just ignore the sliders. And the... Oh! Nope. Screw you in particular. Slide, slide, slider. Nope. Another slider. Sliders! They're everywhere! Oh god, it's like a... No, wait, it's like the parts. Oh, what was that really bad film? He's like... It was, like the birds. it was like the birds, but it was even worse. Birdemic, that's what it was. Oh, that was funny. That was a film. Yeah. I don't think we can... No. We need to beat this grad. Which is a Desperado color grad. I don't think I actually pointed that out. In the episode previous, every, all the soldiers were just kind of normal. But now... Like... Now in this chapter, after we're actually inside Desperado, everything's got the the Desperado red and black colours, you know? It's just a nice wee touch that they added it, because they wouldn't obviously have police colours inside their own headquarters, so daft. Well, not daft, but it's kind of their uniform. Oh, it's a nice wee touch. This game's full of nice touches, like everything that you'd, everything that you'd expect, the little things, you know? It's really great. It's also full of explosions. And jumping on sliders, stabbing them as we go. Stab, stab, stab. Jump. Oh, oh. Should have cut that, but. And now we run up the side of the building instead of down the side of the clock tower. Just avoid these missiles, it's kind of. You don't move very far left and right. Just oh oh! <laughs> I didn't know you could jump. <laughs> what? What is game? Whew. 
seriously, what is this game? Right away is up now, yeah? Almost there. I have just finished analyzing the latest security data. You should find an indoor garden up ahead. A garden? Sounds fancy. A Japanese garden, to be precise. It is an area set aside for VIPs. Apparently, one of World Marshal's directors is a rather serious Japanese culture enthusiast. All right. So what's this got to do with me? Is there something I need from the garden? Not at all. You need only pass through that area to arrive at a freight elevator. I found a route to the elevator controls through the unit we hijacked downstairs. I have located the server room as well. You can reach it via the freight elevator. Great work, Doc. Elementary, my dear Raiden. Now, head for the garden. Man, the head of Desperado sounds like a real Taku. Hey, look at this place. He had it built, and oh my god. I can't see anything. If I had this kind of money, I would probably build this myself, because this looks awesome. <laughs> like, this is a nice... I really start changing colour, going from black and red to blue and, like, pink. Actually really cool looking. Yeah. Kill the otaku soldiers! Go home. Go back to, um... Denver? Or in Denver. <laughs> I'm gonna squish all your koi. How do you like that? Oh god. He doesn't like that. He doesn't care. Oh. Thought I would get something to do with that. Wake up slide. Didn't happen. Didn't happen for me. Oh. Oh man, this is the one level where you feel like a real ninja. It makes me want to play like a like a good Tenchu game. <laughs> oh, that sounds really weird because this game is like the exact opposite of Tenchu. <laughs> but man, I really would like. Anyway, another guy, another hand. I was hoping I could sneak up on him a wee bit because he didn't seem to be doing all that much, honestly. Reading the latest Naruto chapters on his phone. <laughs> you son of. God. Wait. No, the arm's gone. Uh, well, the arm's gone. Screw you. See you in a bit. Right. Back to the garden, back to the ninja, back to the revenge. Kill this guy, kill this guy. Move. Weird blader guys. They're not that bad. Oh. Not quite a large reach actually. I didn't realise this before. I mean, I've previously fought them, but yeah. Got some range. Bang! One shot, one grab, one spine. Getting too hyped. Not not hyped enough actually. This is fairly tame. <laughs> oh, what what just happened there? Come on, get a solid guy. Nah. Wait, maybe? Oh no, nothing built up in there, that's why. Oh. Thought I could get the double grab. It's not happening for me today. No double grabs. Come on round two for you, buddy. Oh. No chain highs. Nothing. No nothing. Just light attacks all day. And Chun Li kicks as well. Oh, oh no. Nope, done it again. See ya. Right, round three. Come on. Round three, I have to get it this time. I just have to believe. I have to believe. Come on, Ryan. Okay, go the arm. That's some bad language. 
not appropriate on this channel, sir. No, no, I'm not gonna try it. It's not dead yet. Cause it's not. Now he's ready to cut. And there we go. He's not. No, he's apparently not dead yet. Let me just. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's for all the grief you just gave me. Three tries at that. Three tries. And only on the third one did I remember that I actually had... Actually, could use Ripper mode now, probably. That's what probably got me there. So, time to proceed through this Japanese garden. Oh, so Japanese. I'm such a ninja right now. Oh, well, oh, can't scale this wall. Not an engine anymore. I'm just gonna bust through it. Boom! It's a tiger. That's a nice tiger on the wolf. In this area, there's another collectible. And there's also tons of masters, but there's no more green hands, so just use Ripper Mode. Use Ripper Mode, and oh yeah! Use Ripper Mode! Don't get grabbed though, because it'll run it down! He's using these tactics to stall it out. This isn't Marvel. I don't play Marvel. Just watch it. Oh! No! I don't have any! No! Now I'm stuck. Yeah, see how hard I was mashing parry there? <laughs> Getting a bit paranoid. Nope, nope. None of that. None of that. Oh, I feel like I'm just mashing at this point. You can probably hear I'm going nuts on this go nuts on this gamepad right here. Oh gee, what? Fair enough. Run and grab, didn't know they could do that. Probably should have known they can do that. Oh, I actually got out of that time and I barely even moved the stick. What happened there? Whoa, 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 jeez. No, no, I'm out. I'm out. Switch to... to something that will probably be really, really useful here. Gee, where's the bloody rockets coming from? That hurt. Ripper again! Yay! He loves Ripper mode, I love Ripper mode. Especially since you can instantly fill it back up afterwards. Yay! Whoa, that guy's a green arm! And I got it off him. Jesus! I, I didn't know that! <laughs> Apparently, there's a lot of you know, green arms that I just weren't prepared for in this stage. Get this guy, get this guy, get this guy, get this guy. Ooh, I hope none of the other ones had green arms, that would be... That wouldn't be good. Um, See, so I think I've taken out most of the enemies in this level. Hey, Woohoo! I'm going to take off this pole arm now, because I want the dive kit back on the slide. Oh, yes, slide enemy. What's in here? Fifth... No, 5,000. <laughs> 5,000 DP. Well, I should be down here, but I got some some DP out of it. Try and get back up. So we need to be on the roofs. Like true ninjas. And also like true ninjas, the wall is painted on. The moon is painted on. And there's collectible data storages. Maybe, yes, maybe. Yeah. Oh, gee, oh, no, 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 no. Get back out there riding. Don't be doing ninja flips on me now. Uh. So yeah, this episode was kind of fun, actually. Oh, I like this. I like doing this 
ninja level. It's just funny to look at how, like, how ridiculous it is that they actually managed to get a ninja garden level into this game. Like, they just decided, oh, Sundowner's a huge otaku. Let's give him a thing because why not? And that's that's actually a perfectly reasonable reason to give someone a giant Japanese garden. So yeah, I think on the next episode we will head down this hallway. I'll see you guys next time.